Alright guys, welcome back. Uh, today's tutorial is a request tutorial and it's about how to convert a tool to a keybind. And as an example for this, I'm gonna use my web move. So you can get the file with this code and then simply drag it into studio. Put everything in the right servers. And set up the animation, but I don't need to do that. Um, okay, now let's yeah make it um, a pocky bind. Normally, it would just work uh, with clicking, uh, activating the tool. But yeah, first we need to change some stuff. Drag the uh, local script out of the tool into starter character script and drag the server script into server script service. And then you can delete the tool. Nice. And then open the local script and we will type. Oh, we first need the, the user input service. So we will type local user input input service is game get service user input service. Then we will type user input service dot input begin connect function. And then we have um, the input and is typing is typing is uh, just there to check if the player is typing in the chat so we don't accidentally activate it while we are typing in the chat so if is typing then return and um now if input dot keycode is enum dot keycode, uh, let's say f, then. Now here we will um, fire the remote event that the server will receive to make the attack. So here we will also need to change the tool dot activated because we don't have a tool anymore. And we can also change this uh, get character func uh, function here yeah. <clears throat> because we also don't need that anymore. Uh, okay. Right. Uh, I think let's go back to the client and hi. Uh, Replicated storage dot events dot grabsname our remote event and fire server. Now let's go into our uh, server script and type events dot grabsname again our remote event uh, dot on server event connect function and now we will get the player like this we can also remove this and change the character to player dot oh player so, oh wait wait right uh remove this of course uh then you can also remove this end because we have the end already down there and then you can do player dot character um, could be already it let's try it out and see if it works yep if you press F it gets activated you can also put a dummy there 
and uh, okay, I am not gonna change my character to Arsix, but you can put a dummy there to see if it's actually working. I'm anchor the dummy. And if you press F, yep, everything works. All right, then this is the video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.